Salutations, Internet, and welcome back to Dewombat Gaming. I'm Dewombat, and we are still playing Pikmin. In the last episode, we finally got the blue Pikmin. We grew over a hundred of them, which is that's it's pretty dandy, if I do say so. And we got two ship parts, so it was a, it was a pretty good day for. We're gonna return to the Forest Naval, see what we can get done today. I don't really have to grow any more Pikmin. I have more than enough for anything that I really need to do. I suppose if I wind up losing a ton of Pikmin, then I would have to grow more. But we'll see what goes on. Today, I believe I'm going to need somewhere around 30... Eh. Maybe only 25 yellow Pikmin. Let's... Let's put five back in. There we go, 25. And then grab... 75 blues. We have to kill some Wallywonks with blues, and since they're not as good of fighters as the uh, red Pikmin, it's going to be harder to kill the Wallywonks. Obviously, these Wallywonks are somewhere off in the uh, in the water, so it's going to be harder to kill them because I have to use the weak blues. I'm going to make everybody into flowers, though. That ought to help. Make them move faster, make them just better fighters in general. Come on, guys. Come on. You got this. Come on. More nectar. More nectar. I think I still have one leaf. That's frustrating, but whatever. Come on. Come on. Alright. Go over this way. <laughs> I like how... Uh, when you use the C stick and you tell your Pikmin to go places, it does. I wonder if they do that in the the Japanese version of the game because that music is, I believe, that's sort of like a traditional American uh, military type music. I wonder if they use the same sound for the Japanese version of the game or any other version of the game for that matter. Yeah! Alright, so we lost a Pikmin. I'm alright with that. To a single Wallywog. Let's see if we can do the same to this guy. Hooah! Get him! Don't let him jump! Don't let him jump! Don't let him jump! Yeah! Alright, good job, Pikmin. I am proud of you. Carry this. The anti-dioxin filter. This fits over the rocket's exhaust ports and filters out all disease-causing agents from the ship's exhaust. That means I'll be able to move around without polluting the planet's atmosphere. I feel worlds better. I'm glad you're such a conscientious individual, Olimar. Good for you. Cool. I don't... Do I really need a full 60 carrying this? I think I'm gonna... Take some back. That's good. Alright. You guys take care of that. Perhaps I can throw you up here to help the yellows do this. No? Alright, don't, don't get crushed by it. That would suck. How about now? There we go. Don't get crushed by it. I'm fairly certain that they can get crushed by it, which is frustrating. Alright, finished that. Which means... We will take the blues... And have them carry this! My Gravity Jumper! By manipulating the forces of gravity, this key component gives me the final boost I need to make the jump to super light speed! Good thing I found it. Alright. I mean, it's a spring. But whatever. Oh, carry that. Now the reason that I have the yellow Pikmin, besides needing them to undo that ramp, is that there are bomb rocks over here. Although I also have to do this ramp as well. Can you guys make sure that you work on the right side of the ramp? You, you guys look like you're hitting it in the wrong direction. There we go. Alright, I think that might take a while, or not. What's this is gonna take? Hmm. I think I'm gonna wait. I don't really... I was considering heading back to base and having them pick up the Ionium jet while I'm over there, but I can do that when I'm closer to base at a different time. Because it's just gonna take time away and really make it harder for me to do the important things that I need to do. Hey there, dead Wallywog. Oh, we got the dioxin filter! Do do do! Boo do 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 do! That was a little off there. The laws of deep space require all ships to eliminate all pollutants. Nine out of thirty, three more parts, and we get to go to the next area. 
Look at this Wally Wog. He looks kind of sad. Poor guy. Does he look kind of sad to you? He looks pretty sad to me. Come on. Come on, guys. Work faster. As your commander, I ordered thee to work faster. Really, this bridge doesn't even technically ha- Alright. Uh, in Pikmin 1, sometimes the Pikmin are idiots, and when they finish working on a bridge for part of it, then they will uh, just sort of run at it instead of smacking it with their faces. So if you notice that they're running instead of using their, their flower heads to do their work, then just sort of call them back and have them do it again. Uh, what was I saying? I didn't technically have to do that, because I could just throw the bomb rock toting Pikmin up on the ledge and run around through the water to get them again, but it's not... It's not horrible doing it this way. Allows the dolphin to swim gracefully through the sea of stars, like a, a dolphin. 10 out of 30. Two more parts, we get to go to the next area. Awesome. Let's use these bomb rocks to good effect. Let me think. Uh, There's... I don't know if that's really necessary to do it that way, is it? There's a part over here and a part over there, and they have to go all the way down this way and across. There is... Gosh, I wish I could show you my finger on the screen or a cursor or something. There is a uh, rock wall right there, that top one right there, and then another one right there, directly into the base. But I think they can just carry it around. I don't know, maybe I should... I think I usually blow up all the walls, so whatever, I'll do it. It's not like I'm trying to go for record time. I've got to keep remember my, reminding myself of that. However, this rock wall takes a lot of bomb rocks. I believe it takes nine out of my 15. Yep. Good job, Pikmin. And I still have six left. I think that might be how many this one takes as well. Come here. Right, six. One, two. Let's see if that blows up the uh, first part of the wall, if it blows up two. Yeah, I think it takes six. We'll test. Probably six. Alas. This one do it? No, take six. I was right. All right, come on, yellows. There is another way to get other bomb rocks. Perhaps I should do that. Or... Another thing I could do is just take these blue Pikmin, put them back in. I don't need 74 of them. In fact, yeah, I think I'll do this. I'm going to go get those two parts that I was talking about. So, how many blues do I need? Like 30, right? 30 blues. 25 yellows is probably okay. 45 reds should be good. That sounds right. Grab them. Let's see if I can get this done in one day. Man, most of these reds are no longer flowers. That's a pity. Come on, guys. Maybe I'll turn you into flowers. I think that there is some delicious, delicious nectar down here. There is indeed. Spin you guys around might be uh, taking unnecessary time to do this. Oh well. Alright, come on guys. Good enough. Most of you are flowers. Are all of you flowers? Are you a flower? All of you are flowers. Good job. I'm happy about that. Uh, we're going to run over this way and fight this blowhog. Get him. Now, he's going to light several of the Pikmin on fire, because I don't have uh, only red Pikmin. Uh, I lost several in the water as well. That's too bad. Oh, well. Wasn't paying attention. I think I heard them drowning, but, nah, whatever. They need to break down this wall. Come on, 90 Pikmin should be good enough. You know, I think I'm going to go grab some more reds. 
So I think that's probably the most... Uh, maybe a couple of yellows and some reds. Just to be safe. Sure, three yellows. And then some reds. Because the, the thing is... In order to carry these treasures back, they have to carry them through these fire spouts. So you need reds to do the heavy lifting. But there's also a couple of spots where you have to throw Pikmin very high to grab something, and there's also something in the water. So it's not the easiest. What? Did I just... Did a Pikmin get stuck somewhere? Where? Yeah, Pikmin got stuck behind this wall. Idiot! Come here! There we go. Stupid leaf Pikmin, so slow. Derpy. If you're not careful, they're just gonna sit around and be dumb. Perfect! I had enough time to grab these guys. Help destroy this. Help destroy it. Perfecto mundo! Grab them all. And let's try and keep them all from lighting themselves on fire by having them hug the wall. Perfect. Distribute them. Yes, uh, the reds and the yellows can work on this bridge. Oh, come on, game, why are your mechanics so hard to freaking use properly? Whatever. 25 is probably enough. Let's go, blues. Come on. Come on. I saw one of your trip. Come on. Not get burned alive. Pick up this thing. Hopefully it only takes 25. How much does it take? My analog computer. This computer conveys the kind of vague data that falls outside the range of ones and zeros. Actually, to be honest, it's a little bit too vague, so it isn't very helpful. Well, then why do I need to get it? Okay, it only takes 20. Good job, Pikmin. Is there a way to get up over here? What's this ramp for? Oh, there's a candy pop bud. That, if you throw Pikmin into it... Oh, hey there, beetle. It will turn the Pikmin into the color of the Candy Pop Bud. Alright, I don't want to waste these blues on here, because they're just going to burn to death if we try. Instead, uh, use over here. Continue doing that. How many reds is over here? Not enough, that's only eight. Reds. That's enough. All right, you guys can carry that. So let's head over there and grab that. They can just head home. Don't have to worry about them. Do your job. Good enough. Ow, fire hurts my body. I gotta be careful. Almar's very low on health. If I run into more fire, he could die. That is indeed something that could happen. All right, grab the blues. Have them break open that geyser because I have to get up there. Perfect job. Good job. Happy for you. Then grab the yellows. That's probably enough. Throw them up. I think you only need like 15, but better safe than sorry, right? And you have to grab that thing. I think that one's called the Libra. It could be the Sagittarius. They both look exactly the same. I'm a Libra. The scales. Perfect. Carry it down. Don't do that. Yeah, lose your flowers like a bunch of morons. Whatever. Uh, guys, can you not flip it? What are you... What the... That is... What? Uh, it's the Libra. My daughter gave this to me. It's named after her astrological sign. My sweet little girl. I wonder what she's doing right at this moment. She never gets a name. I'd like to name her something. She can be... Uh... Bomb Quisha. Chiquayquay. You idiots! Why would you do that? Come here! Stop drowning! Oh my gosh! Holy crap! I dismiss them for a moment, and instead of just standing where they are or something, they freaking do that. Like a bunch of morons. Carry that. Come on. Carry it, carry it, carry it, carry it. Good enough. Grab the rest of the Pikmin, and let's head home. Perhaps pick up that Ionium jet that we left there. Also, we can heal ourselves at the ship if we need to. 
No more fire jets, which means we can have the maximum number of Pikmin carrying that. And you know what? Let's, uh... Let's make some more yellow Pikmin. Why not, right? We have plenty of time. It's not like I can go grab another part, so we'll have them carry those. Good job, Pikmin. Make more of you. Make me proud. Make me Pikmin babies. Why do you guys insist on going up that way when I did this so nicely for you? Is this only for me? Can you not carry things up this? That's frustrating. Frustrating and annoying. Okay, let's grab that Ionium jet. And hey, you guys made it with the computer. Good job. <laughs> This strengthens the outward emotions of the dolphin's computer. While it does make the computer smart, it also makes it quick to anger. It's just like my boss. Oh dear, I don't I don't appreciate uh, computers with angry artificial intelligence. Let's quickly get this into base. I bet we can I bet we can do it. With maximum yellow Pikmin carrying it. I mean yellow. Maximum flower Pikmin is what I meant. Hup to, hup to, get it up here. Good job. And here come the rest of the things. I think that we're good. I think we managed. Oh yeah. Perfect. This is a good day. We got, what, five parts? Blew up some walls? Got our Ionium jet? That one appears on the side. Bing! If this is damaged, I'll be in dire straits. I'll have to run a system check as soon as I can. 12 out of 30 parts increasing the dolphin's capabilities! My search can now cover a wider area! Hooray! We have a spinny egg beater like thing on the ship. Don't know what it's for. But it's there. And hey, the Libra also appears. Makes our ship look cool. My daughter gave this to me. My late return must have have her very worried. Poor bomb Quisha. Shakwake. So you noticed it said uh, 16 more parts until we improve the dolphin's capability. Oh, I'm missing a Pikmin somewhere. Oh, that poor yellow. I'm not going to get him, guys. We're going to watch him die. Uh, Bumquisha. Getting your Libra has killed one of the Pikmin. I hope you're happy. I sacrificed his life to get your present. <laughs> okay, I'm over it. We're gonna see him die. I think he's gonna get squished by a Wally Wonk. Everybody's everybody's safe except for the one yellow. Here we go! Blasting off again. Oh no, don't kill him! Uh Oh! Poor Francis. That was his name. The Pikmin that I did not bring back to the Onion all vanished overnight. It may well be that they have fallen prey to the planet's nocturnal creatures. An ugly thought. Perhaps that is why they follow me into the atmosphere. I'm starting to grasp the cycles of life on this planet. You don't seem as mournful as I do, Olimar. We just lost some good Pikmin today. 90, 70, 103? Good enough! We have 13 in 5 days. That's pretty dang awesome. So I suppose that's the end of this episode. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Click that like button if you did like it. Subscribe for more videos. I update as often as I can. And I will see you guys next time where we don't go in the distant spring, but we finish off the forest navel. See you then. <laughs>